What's good everybody? So tonight I decided to make this video because I wanted to support the young gay communities out there right now. You're confused, you're worried, you're trying to figure out who you are. This video is for you. When I was very young, four or five, I understood subconsciously and in some ways consciously that I had some sort of intimate feelings for men. Uh, my first crush was like Matthew Lawrence from like the uh, Brotherly Love series, Boy Meets World. Um, I just thought he was really cute and f cool and funny, but I didn't understand why I had those attractions. Why I didn't understand why I felt boys were cute. But at a certain age, as you get older, you start to figure out and you get the concepts of men and women and, and that men are supposed to be with women and, and you're supposed to have a girlfriend as a man and as a young teenager, uh, young adult, um, uh, as a kid even. And as I grew up and grew older and, and finally started to figure myself out as I uh, left high school, I accepted certain things about myself that I was so unsure of as, as a kid. So my advice to so many of you young men out there right now, you're going through a lot of issues trying to figure out who you are. Um, there's nothing wrong with, with accepting yourself, accepting your sexuality. This video is not to tell you that you're gay. This video is to tell you that you need to live, that you need to figure out what you want to do with your life. Uh, meet the right people. Understand that some people are going to come in your life and some people are going to come out. They're not always going to be there to stay. You're going to form a few handfuls of friendship. My dad told me that you only get a good a, a, about a good handful of friendships that are actually going to last throughout your entire life. And those people won't go anywhere. Even if you don't talk for years, if you pick up the phone the next day, you haven't spoken to them in two years, it's going to be like you never stop talking to them. Um, there's going to be so many things, guys, that you're going to experience. You're going to get your heart broken a lot by these guys because they're confused, because they they are egotistical, they are overconfident, um, they want to play the field. And maybe you're not that way. Maybe you're more relationship oriented. But just allow yourself, guys, to live. Don't be so attached. Be attached to yourself. Be in a relationship with yourself. When I say that, that means... Figure out what you want to do with your life. Don't let your whole life be catered to trying to figure out who this other person is. You have so much time for that. I promise you, you will. And I can't promise you that the the people that come in your life that you love, that you grow an attraction to, that you think you want to be with for the rest of your life are always going to be there. You have to have a relationship with yourself first and with God and with your family and just be truthful with them. It's going to be hard. Um, it's not the easiest thing to undergo, I promise you. Um, not everyone's parent, not everyone's guardian, whoever is in your life that's over, you know, taking care of you, they're, they're, there's going to be so many different mixed emotions that they have. And just make sure that you have a clear understanding of what you think that you want to incorporate in your life so it's an easier transition for them. Once again, this video is not to tell you that you're gay, that you are this, I'm going to preach this to you. It's about figuring your life out, experiencing things that, that you that you may write about, that you may see on TV, that you think is, is, is like that when I promise you that it's not. You have to experience certain things in your life to, to figure out how, what, what it would be like for you. So that's my advice for you guys. Live. That 18 to 21 phase is so detrimental and vital. And as you get older, you start to figure out concepts about yourself, your strengths, your weaknesses, your personality traits, the things that you like about yourself, the things that you want to change about yourself. And those are what's going to help you become the person that you're going to be, whether you're attracted to men, women, what have you. Just be yourself, be educated, be professional, figure out what you want to do with your life, and you'll have all the time in the world to date and to discover who the person is that you look at every day when you're in the bathroom, washing your face, brushing your teeth. Be yourself, love yourself, understand what loving yourself means, and I promise you, you will be okay. All right? I love you guys. You guys are wonderful. Hit me up if you have any questions about what it's like to transition from a teenager to a young adult and feel like you have these feelings for the same sex. 
or what have you. It's your boy Langston John Blaze. Good night, Crusaders. Peace.